Hey YouTube, this is Geckos Row 11, and um, in my video Eggs Hatched Part 1, you guys saw that the eggs hatched, and one of them is a stripe, and I thought the other one was a normal, but it turns out it's um, some type of a tangerine something. Um, so, see, come here, sorry. Okay, his colors went from black to more of a purple color. And, um, he's turning more orange, and then there's an orange line on his tail. So, um, I'm pretty sure he's like a tangerine or something. Um, there's little crickets in there. Here's the stripe. He's just got really nice coloring. So, they're both doing great. I got six small crickets. And, um, three of them are left. So, the stripe is more of an eater. But... The other one's just because it's younger, but, um, so I'll show you the parents, too. I just fed everyone. I just need to clean up my room a little bit, so, um, here's the mom, female stripe, Chloe. I just fed her lots of wax worms and stuff, and, oh, sorry, that's Claire's cage. Male tangerine sun glow head trimper. Giant, he's giant too, um, Vince. Mm -hmm. So, basically, also, I just want to let you guys know, I'm going to the San Diego Reptile Super Show on the June 26th and 27th. Um, so that's this weekend coming up. I'm going with Herp's Art 09. Um, so I'm also, tomorrow, which is Thursday, I'm going to put dividers down the middle of the rack, um, the tubs, I mean. So, um, that'll be a good-sized tub. Not, not like all the way 15 quart or something like that but it'll still work because I really want to start saving electricity so if I put all my if I divide this up and I put all my geckos in then I'll have one extra tub down here one extra area so I'm gonna get a, a snow bold stripe and a bold stripe at the expo so I'll put the female bold stripe in there and then I'll use one of these for a male snow bold stripe and then after that um, I'm gonna take a long break from buying reptiles and I'm going to start buying, um, I'm going to buy a leopard gecko rack, a hatching rack, more thermostats, and then after that, um, I'll have the leopard gecko rack right there, ball python rack, which is that one, but, you know, and then I want to start getting into crested geckos, and then it's just going to go on to my corn snakes, which I'm not going to do much breeding, I mean, if I got her, um, Samantha sexed a long time ago, so she might be a boy, because w when you, the guy sexed her, she was really little, so, um, if she turns out to be a boy, I'm just going to get an albino, breed it to the anarchistic, and hopefully get snow corn. So, that's my plan. And then here's the baby frog. Let me find him. I just, oh, here he is. He's coming. You see him swimming right there? He's got his legs. You can see that little line by his feet, the little yellowish line. So, um, I got him some leaves and everything. His water is nice and clean. I got this bag of stuff too, trying to get to grow al algae. So, yep. So that's pretty much it. That's just a little update on everyone. Everyone's doing really good. So, um, there's Molly. Molly's doing good. Halloween mask leopard gecko. So, oh, by the way, one more thing. If you want to learn about a Halloween mask leopard gecko, a lot of people don't think it's a real morph, but it is. Go to Pack Herp uh, on YouTube. It's P A C H E R P. She has pack. I um, she has Halloween mask leopard geckos. So um yeah. Okay then. Uh, enjoy and subscribe. Goodbye.